welcome back to our St. John's VBS Compassion Camp. It is so good to see you guys again. Today I am wearing one of my favorite outfits, and that is because the theme for today is all about asking God to help us love ourselves. Have I mentioned how happy I am to see you? I care about you so much. And do you know what? I care about myself too. Just before I joined you guys, I was brushing my teeth. Look, I've got my toothbrush, my toothpaste, and I even flossed this morning. So let's all take a minute, and if you guys can go grab your toothbrushes. Okay, I wanna see what you use to brush your teeth and how you brush your teeth. So let's take a minute. All right, everybody got them? All right, so let's pretend to brush our teeth really quick. Just make sure you don't spit all over the table when you do this. <laughs> so what, why do you brush your teeth? What happens when you brush your teeth? Is it to keep our teeth clean and healthy as we grow older? We take care of our teeth because we love our bodies and we want them to be healthy and last for a long time. What else do we do because we love ourselves? What kind of exercise do you do? What kind of music do you like to listen to? What kind of books do you like to read? And what movies do you like to watch? In church, we talk a lot about loving others, but we first must start by loving ourselves. When we care for our own needs, we're ready to care for other people's needs too. So today our song is about loving others and remembering that God loves us and we love ourselves. Today's Bible story is Mark 12, 28 to 31, which is a story about the greatest commandment, loving God. Our verse to remember today is, the first is, Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God, the Lord is one. You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, with all your mind, and all your strength. The second is, you shall love your neighbor as yourself. This is Mark 12, 29 through 30. As we look at the story today, we will hear some of the most famous words of Jesus. Instead of giving people a long list of commands or rules to follow, Jesus gave only two. But the best way to follow these two famous commandments, we should start by knowing how wonderful, loved, and important we are ourselves. As we prepare to learn more about having compassion for ourselves, Let's begin with our compassion prayer. Place one hand on your heart and another hand on your head. This is because compassion happens in our brains, but we feel it in our hearts. Repeat after me, gentle one. Thank you for your spirit within us, who guides, encourages, and strengthens us. Help us to see ourselves through your eyes with love, kindness, and deep joy. May we love our bodies and treasure our hearts and celebrate our spirits. Amen. All right, so now we're gonna do our craft for today. So for this, we've got a glass jar, some clear glue, and some glitter. And then if you have it, you can use distilled water or tap water. And you can use food coloring. So today we're making glitter jars. So you're gonna start with the jar. And you're gonna fill it about a third of the way with water, whether it's tap water or distilled water. So we'll do that. Okay, and then you're going to add a good amount of clear glue. Don't know quite how much a good amount is, but you want to just eyeball it until there's a good amount of glue at the bottom of the jar. 
We're going to try that. You can always adjust later if you need to. And then you're going to put in as much glitter as you want. So I got purple glitter because that's my favorite color. There we go. So you can put in as much glitter as you want. Remember, you can always add more later. You can't take it out though. And then for me, I'm gonna add a little bit of blue and red food coloring to make it a little bit more purple. But again, you can do one color, you can do different colors, whatever you want. A little bit more water to bring it not quite all the way up to the top. All right, at this point, you're going to put the lid on nice and tight. Make sure you have an adult for this part and tighten it as much as you can. All right, and then we're going to shake it around, and you've got a glitter jar. Alrighty, there are three things to remember for tonight. First, make sure you dress up in either your favorite outfit or your favorite color. Second, make sure you bring your glitter jar that you made. And third, try to remember the verse of the day, which is Mark 12, 29 to 30. The first is, Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God, the Lord is one. You shall love your God with all your heart, with all your soul, with all your mind, and with all your strength. The second is you shall love your neighbor as yourself. See you all tonight. Soul, I have love for.